currently situated at Grand Millennium Hotel. I am here at the ground floor and one thing that is so remarkable here in this particular hotel is they surrounded this hotel with various types of plants. As you can see there are mangoes here and another type of plants also that is surrounding that's part of the landscape here yet another surprising truth is that this particular hotel and its and its management it was able to to grow tamarindus indicus Yes, you hear it right. It's Tamarindus Indicus or Tamarind. In Tagalog, it is Sampalok. It was not long that this has been growing here. I remember before when I passed through here, this is yet very small during the time. I think from the base itself, it was only the size, this one. So if it is going to stand vertically, that was the size of it. Yet, in the past four years, I could notice that it is continuously growing. It means that the soil here, even if it is sandy, see this is the setting of the soil here, it is dusty and it is sandy also yet perhaps because of the constant watering because there is a water system here the drip irrigation you might have recalled it is giving water continuously that enables this tamarindus indicus to grow one thing that is remarkable about Tamarindus indicus is that when it is growing, it seems that Tamarindus indicus have elasticity of the branch itself because even if you are somewhat like weighty, the branch in itself is not easily giving in. It's not even easily be fallen or it is not easily be broken because it has its elasticity in it in it so it became so strong even if you're going to be reaching the summit of it it will not fall I remember before in Bicol it made me able to harvest a sack of tamarind fruit Yes, if we're going to check from afar, so the summit of it is already full of separate branch. So it branched already from the summit. It didn't grow straight, but it branched. And it allows the other parts of the Tamarindus indicus to grow and to expand its branch to the left and even to the right as you can notice one of the reasons why it stays like that because the leaves are actually smaller like this one it's just like the ipil ipil so it means that when the pressure of the of the air like turbulence will not be able to penetrate its core because the air in itself will just be passing through easily so the impact is lesser it will just pass through easily so that made this tamarindus indicus to grow in that manner and it didn't even shows like it gets wilted even during summer 
no it continues to grow and we are hoping that it will give us fruits in the near future so guys thank you for watching sas tv official i am just bringing to you how we are exploring the desert plants here and that includes Tamarindus indicus and it is integrated here in the urban centers we're in in the middle of the hotel we call it Grand Millennium Hotel in Alohana you will be able to see the the growing Tamarindus indicus I think this Tamarindus indicus will compete with the height of the building here it's really tall